welcome to another video from Grail 60. When something breaks in your house, like your water heater, you phone the company that built it and they send out a repairman and the repairman comes for 40 RMB. He comes to your house to, to diagnose your problem. Okay, so our water heater went down this morning and we got the, the Cambo water heater man in to fix it. So he's, he's here, he came, we phoned this morning and it's two o'clock in the afternoon and he comes right to your door and he comes in and he, he fixes it. Yeah, and it looks a little complicated in there too, eh? He's got all the equipment to diagnose it and stuff, so I would have just looked at that and said, I don't know. So the thing is that if there needs to be a part replaced in it, then we have to pay for that part. That's the, the, and it's probably just as cheap as a guy coming over. In the West, what you would have to do is you would have to take the water heater off the wall, send it back to the manufacturer. You'd be out without the water heater for how long, and they don't care. And you'd be, well, you might as well just go out and buy a new one is, is what, it, what it comes down to. So that was my first reaction when, uh, when the water heater went down was to, wow, let's just go buy a new one. But Wei Fong, she says, why would you go buy a new one if you can uh, pay somebody 40 RMB to come over and fix it and just pay for the parts? And you know, I have to agree with her. Rather than throwing things away all the time like a Westerner would do, and you know, that's one of the things I've learned over here. Well, I'm learning, I, d I'm, I haven't learned it yet because I was still ready to throw that water heater away. And uh, no, she says, you know, why throw it away? So, we didn't throw it away. We got the Cambo water heater man to come in and fix it. It's just like the Maytag washing machine man comes and fixes your washer back in the 50s and 60s. You know, and that's another thing. You know, between 30 and 50 RMB, you can have a repair person come to your place. If it's a high-end product, like the Gree air conditioners, then you yeah, have 50 RMB to have them come. And, and take a look at it, and then you got to pay the price for the parts. But it's a lot cheaper than throwing them away, I'll tell you that right now. You know, uh, cell phone, if you, if you break your screen on your cell phone, your iPhone 5, down at the end of the block for 4 to $5 Canadian, they'll replace it for you. It's, and it only takes a half an hour. You know, so fixing things here is so common compared to the Western world that you know people they don't say oh i'm going to just go buy a new one they say oh no call the repairman and they've all got the receipts and they've got the little cards that has the repairman's phone number on it i've never seen that before if somebody says oh my washing machine went down in canada i better go call the repairman here let me go get my documents <laughs> you know what i mean that's just not going to happen in china that's the way they do things so it's different here it's it's better here, it's, it makes way more sense here, and it's more economical, and it probably employs more people than in the West. So it's just the way China is, and it's a good thing, I think. Oh, okay, so the part costs six, 65 RMB, and then 40 RMB for the guy to come and put it in. So 105 RMB, so our hot water heater got fixed for 20 bucks. $20 Canadian in six hours our hot water heater goes down and then it's back up again six hours later for $20 and all we had to do is make one phone call to the manufacturer here in Nanning. <laughs> I love China. China is a good place. It's so convenient. It's so inexpensive and I'm going to have a hot shower because I just got home from the gym and I sweat my butt off and I stink pretty bad. So there. This piece here. Oh, okay. This piece here died. I don't know what it is. Any of you techies out there or fix it kind of guys would know what that is. Maybe. I think. I have no idea. So and that's another short little video on fixing a water heater in China from Guaylao 60. If you like it, as always, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you're thinking. Thanks for watching. Bye now.